Hey everyone, it's Vida Vine and we're going today to a special place called, what's it called? Anstey Hill. <laughs> it's not too far away from us and we're going to have a look at the uh, quarries that are there and uh, some old ruins and things um, and it'll be really really fun so we're looking forward to that and so I just wanted to tell you that that's where we're going, it's kind of like a weird vlog, that's why I've got this um, strange hair and hat and all that sort of thing. Um, my husband's coming too, so we'll be uh, chatting to you from Anstey Hill. Bye! Hey everyone, so we're here where we've just turned up at gate number two and we're about to go and explore what's down the track. Now Anstey Hill's got a lot of uh, history in Adelaide. It's where the Aboriginals used to live for thousands of years and then they've closed all this area off uh, they've closed all this area off now so that it's all protected but there's, apparently there's 145 species of native birds there's kangaroos, um, echidnas, all sorts of animals and there's these quarries there where we can look for dolomite and quartz and um, apparently silver and gold apparently as well so I don't know, we'll see what we come up with so we're gonna uh, I'll just keep the camera going and we'll go for this walk okay. now okay we can go left or we can go right <laughs> I think we'll go uh, left because it's got the I've got my map here uh, this way Up. I'm gonna say hello. Hi. <laughs> Chris is with us too. He's the pack horse, he's carrying everything. <laughs> now we were gonna bring out dogs, but you know, you can imagine. Um, just thought we'd check it out first. And you guys are coming with us. This is cool. Made sure I charged this camera last night. You can see, already see there's some beautiful um, lights coming through. There's probably a lot of spirits here. Now we worked out that the old Newman's nursery, which a uh, family called the Newman's obviously, they um, had 17 children and they had this, the biggest nursery in the southern hemisphere. And they have an old house somewhere. Um, it's a bit further away from here, so we'll go maybe next time. But wow, so cool. like houses down around us here. There's plenty of sandstone here as well. A lot of the buildings in the city of Adelaide were made with these sandstones. Gotta get my legs moving. over here. I've also got my pendulum with me so we'll see if we can find things using the pendulum. What's wrong? We stopped. Go around this corner. There. That's where we came in, we turned left. Yeah. I don't know whether this is going. Yeah, I think it's that way. That way? Okay, go on back around this way. Mm. 
Oh, it's hard to. I'm trying not to wiggle, but it's hard not to wiggle when you're walking. Thank goodness we stopped going up that hill for a minute. <laughs> It's a beautiful day, luckily. We were going to come really early this morning, but neither of us actually got up in time. It's full of gum trees. There's a big mountain there. I don't know if you can see it. Chris is finding rocks. Well, we're also going to do um, make some rocks into like a little bit of a uh, energy vor vortex while we're here. Oh, there's a path going up that way too. Oh, there's this marker there. I wonder what boundary walk. back again <laughs> oh. okay we've already got a little piece of um, quartz Chris found a little piece of quartz oh wow all right well I'm gonna be finding these little things as we go along okay all right we're going we're going beyond we're going through we might not even be allowed in there but we're going anyway I can't see any ranges about <laughs> And then a lot of things were wiped out because in 1983 we had bushfires called Ash Wednesday it just wiped out so much. Um, so much of the vegetation. Just oh it was terrible. All the Adelaide Hills were on fire. Because we don't live too far from the Adelaide Hills, I hope it doesn't happen again. Some pretty steep places in here. See the light shining through everything, it's beautiful. Dolomite, see, here's a big piece. It's like quartz, no, actually, quartzite. Well, we don't want to be carrying rocks all day, so I'm going to leave it. I'm going to move it and leave it. All right, here we go. This is pretty steep up here. How cool is that light coming through? I can see it on the camera. Our poor old legs haven't done this kind of walk for a long time. Oh. 
to quartz. I think my legs are going to die. Oh, you wouldn't believe how steep this is. Okay, you can do it. Gosh. Okay. I don't know if you can see how high this is from here. Hang on, we're gonna keep going. He's, he's going around the bend. Sorry, you can hear me breathing so heavily. I'm embarrassed. Whew. It's not gonna all be uphill, thank goodness. this tree. I think we need a walking stick. Oh, here we go. Wow. Let me try to zoom in a bit. There's the city. We've come up really high. Any wonder my legs are dying. So this is only like 20 minutes away from the city of Adelaide, so that's pretty cool. Okay, we're going up even further. That was good, I needed that little break. Oh, it's a kangaroo trail. Looks like the trail itself looks like lots of water just comes flying down here. It's like an old creek bed. I hope you're not too bored. <laughs> I guess if you don't live in Australia, you'd be interested. <laughs> Look at this, there's tons of rocks here. Thousands of rocks. We must be getting closer to a quarry. Oh, I can see a big piece of quartz there. I'm not gonna grab that out. The more rocks we've got, the harder it is to get up. Got to go up there. Whew. It's really steep, guys. Because I mean, I'm not that unfit, and I could barely move up this hill. Whew. I feel like a billy goat. Spirits there. Nearly up top. Oh gosh. Well, hang on, we're gonna get an even better view up here. Whew. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're on flat ground. Hallelujah. Yep, we'll have a look over here. I'll zoom in. Oh, 
Oh wow, there's the actual city. Hang on. Look. The city buildings. Unbelievable. Whoops, there they are. Wow. There's the city of Adelaide, how cool. Isn't that crazy? It's amazing what we can do with these cameras. You can even see the ocean way out there. Okay. So, that just gives you an idea of how high we were up. Somewhere down there is our house. <laughs> wow. All right, now, we are coming. That's where we were just, we were, um, well, if we kept going up that way, then it's going to be quite treacherous. But we're going to continue along there. We've got our um, little map here. We're probably miles away from anywhere at the moment. Yep. So we keep going up there, or? All right. Go up a bit more. Yep. Hope you guys can see this light shining down through this. It's amazing. All right. Uh, okay, we're going up even. We're up, going up again. Legs have recovered a little bit. Here we go on this track again. The hardest part is just coming up on the stones, I guess. Wildflowers and things, trees, poor old tree. Oh, this is not as steep as the other part, thank goodness. Whew. Oh, yeah, he said there's a top. Oh, sweet, there's some wildflowers. <laughs> it's hard to see in the camera. Yeah, pretty little wildflowers. Just there by themselves. Oh my goodness. Wait, you know what it's like when you're coming to the top of a hill. Okay, see? There's the... Oh my god. Holy Hannah. This is the quarry. So this is the quarry. Holy mackerel. It's just all been cut away. It goes right around. There's two levels. Oh my god. Looks like you can get down there though. Yep. If we keep walking we can we, get down there. We would have walked around and wouldn't come up. We wouldn't. All this. But we wouldn't have seen all this if we didn't brave it up the hill. Oh gosh, I hope you guys can see this. It's a little bit scary for me because I don't really like heights. It's not so much the heights, it's the falling from the heights. 
There's something dug out down there. There's something dug out. Oh yeah. Looks like we, if we can follow this path around. Wow. Isn't this amazing? I'm glad we came up here. I hope you guys can really see this. Wow, this is amazing. All right, we're gonna continue and try to find our way down there. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Well, I wonder how, well, how many feet is that? Well, we've got a fork in the road. That way looks shorter. You try that way then? As in. As in getting around. Oh my goodness. How many feet high you reckon? Hundreds. <laughs> It's like hundreds when you're looking down, doesn't it? I love old trees, it's just so beautiful. It's crazy good fun. We have to go that way, it looks like it stops here. <laughs> Sorry about us, we haven't been up here before, so we don't know the whole gist of everything. Because we don't want to fall now with all this. Oh, it looks like you can get in there, look. Wow. Wow, and who would have thunk this is just five minutes from our house? We've got all this to sit around and play with. This is crazy. Can we make it down this way? Okay, we're going. Thank goodness we're going down though. Husband leads the way, thank goodness. Oh, we're going down there. Wow. Wow. Oh. This is amazing. Now this is only just one part of this um, whole uh, recreation park. It's huge. Oh my goodness. Switch off you come down, yeah, I'm just going to switch off guys because uh, it's going to be quite treacherous down here. <laughs> 